Uh, I'm Doug Howlett. I'm chairman of the Suffolk Family History Society. Uh, we have six groups based in Suffolk, and they're in uh, Lower Stock, which is our founding uh, group. Uh, we have Ipswich, Sudbury, Bury St Edmunds, Haverhill, and Stowmarket. In addition to that, we have a group based in the west of London that concentrates their efforts researching family history in and around their family in Suffolk. The societies meet generally on a monthly basis and we have uh, talks 10 times during the course of the year. The uh, beauty of joining the society is that you're able to meet up with like-minded people who are not only interested in uh, genealogy but the social fabric in which the families, their kin, were brought up. Well, I think there's uh, two main um, uh, things that I would suggest. One is uh, if they have access to uh, ancestry, that's a real boon. And in Suffolk, you can get uh, access via the libraries as a little starter to see if you're interested and if family history is for you. In addition to that, if you join the local, your local society, they're able to put more of the fabric uh, around the basic facts that you can find from the parish records. I'd also recommend that people uh, seek to view the actual documents or transcriptions of them in their record office. Uh, it, there's a wealth of information. Uh, technology is um, helping us all the time and I think it's uh, wrong to simply say you must only go to the basic records. You've got to embrace technology because it really does help. Basically, you start off, don't you, with births, marriages and deaths. Um, that's three events in one person's life. That person might have lived for 70 years. There's an awful lot more of the story than that's those three dates. So the more you can find out, find out with a local history, it's, it's a, a boon and it really brings that person mean, meaningful into your family tree. I think, I think the um, interesting thing about Suffolk is that you can always find um, uh, different pronunciations. There's, uh, uh, we have very strong dialects across the, the, the Suffolk landscape and um, you can uh, find people pronounce towns and villages in totally different ways. Uh, we also uh, find that um, there are, I wouldn't say tribalism, but uh, we almost say, well, that's over on the east of Suffolk and we're from the west, vice versa. You know? So you, you do have friendly rivalry between uh, east and west and from village, from village to village. Uh, it's, it's a very, very interesting and beautiful place to be based. <laughs> well, Doug, I, need, I, I, I need notice of that one. <laughs>